Alright, hey, what's going on? It's Monkey Guard. Um, today I'm going to be showing you my outfits, my top five that I have gathered along the time that I've been playing on the Runescape account. If you've seen me anywhere in game, you can pretty much notice that I'm wearing this um, with the cooking cape. This is Witch Doctors and the Wings. Um, it's Phoenix Crossbow. Um, I'll be showing you my top five today. Um, the Salvation Aura requires 5k loyalty points. I bought it with the Christmas um, 6k, so I have a little bit remainder left. Um, Phoenix Crossbow, Witch Doctor Robes, and Lord Marshall. Now, I looked, a lot, looked through a lot of um, YouTube videos, and a lot of the skiller outfits are the same. And I'm trying not to do that to you today. I'm trying to pick out my top five. This is my top one, obviously, because I love the look of Witch Doctor. My second one is the Lord Marshall look. Um, you can either choose a um, trousers or the skirt, which unfortunately they still have not fixed, which I hope they will in the future, but this is glitched right here. That's the only drawback, but if you don't want to, these are fine. The skirt is not glitched with the crossbow. Or you could simply just wear a training bow. A lot of people I talk to personally like this setup right here, and so do I too. This was my setup um, before I got um, Witch Doctor, which requires 80 Hunter and various other stats if you watch my videos to get. Um, this is a Master Penance Horn, and um, it is currently like tier 4. I got Collector and Attacker, which you can do from Barbarian Assault. It's not too hard, it just takes a while. I'm doing it with friends, so it's a lot easier. So this is my second, my third favorite outfit was the Rune Crafting robes with the Omni Talisman, which is a good look even for free to play or if you're a member skiller. It's all around. Uh, I got the blue boots, so it does go good. You can change your boots like this from the costume or the somewhere in the bedroom of anyone, any higher level house. Um, and my second to last one requires the ornate katana, which not a lot of people have. Um, you had to buy a three month membership card a long, long time ago. Like, not too long, but less than a year, but more than six months, I think. But this set I got. I think it looks cool just to mess around in. The katana with the aura is cool, especially with the tier 2 aura. I have Jack of Trades, which helps a ton on Slayer. I'm almost 62, which is fantastic. It's better than Penguin Points. But I don't really like moving around in it because you look kind of a retard. But, yeah, and you're probably wondering what the hell, where's the fifth one? But before we get to that, um,. I noticed a bunch of people ask me where my money pouch is. Well, it's still there. It's just my graphics detail is weird. And until I actually interact with it or add money or take money, it does not show up normally. So I'm sorry uh, for the confusion for anyone out there. Um, it stays if I withdraw money. I uh, can't show you the pen. not willing. But, yeah, if I take it out, it stays. But I just have to do something with it. But my fifth one, I have to say is um, my default clothes, which is right here. You might be thinking, wow, that's not really an outfit, but I think it is. I mean, it looks good. Um, uh, um, if you're wondering what it is, I can show you really quick, but when I'm just um, doing room crafting or anything, something, you need always need something to look nice and look white in. And I think this is it. Um, I don't know if they fix running this morning, but it looks really weird, at least to me. But, um, here we go. I think I have everything off. Alright, yep, we can count. It is the mesh crew neck with the Black Knight and the worn out breeks, I believe it's called, with the Black Knight too. A lot of people do overload black wherever it is right there overload black it's not quite the same it's almost gray looking which kind of sucks but yeah I'm um, sorry I didn't, I'm not trying to copy anyone by this I know a lot of 
um, outfit guides are out there and I do appreciate the people who do try but a lot of them are repetitive like they use Kayat and stuff like that what, what, which most people don't generally use as an outfit um, another thing just to add is the doctor's top that always goes good with um, flared trousers or something like that same with the sacred clay butterfly neck mime gloves you can go for a cabbie which, that looks really good same with the battlefield cloaks if you don't have a skill cape these are a great great alternative they come in blue black and green and you can pretty much visit any citadel and get them they do come in green so you're gonna have to do change and you can do red neutral which is green or blue which is that they can be colored to whatever reason before this a lot of people see me in this outfit right here it looked good at least to my opinion which is the only one that really counts when it comes to outfits but yeah sorry if uh, I bored you with this but I'm just trying to get some good skill and outfits out there and for people to see and to appreciate but thanks guys uh, don't forget to comment rate and subscribe to me to show your support thanks